Hello everybody and welcome back to Yalan app. In this video, I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step guide on exactly how to fix the server authentication process failed in Pokemon TCG Pocket app. So if you're currently having that exact same problem and you want to be able to fix it, well then this video is going to be perfect for you because actually me myself, I had the exact same problem before and I'm going to show you how I was able to fix it quite quickly. So what I did firstly was that I closed my Pokemon TCG Pocket app and instead I went into my settings app. So go back into your settings app and then what you're going to do, you're going to scroll down and then you're going to click on general and here as you can see, scroll down again and click on storage. And this uh, should now take you to this page right here as you can see. And in here, we're just going to scroll down, click on the Pokemon TCG P app, click on offload app and once again, click on offload app. Just wait a couple of seconds for this here to load and click on reinstall app as you can see. And now on the Pokemon app as you can see on the Pokemon TCG pocket app it says loading here now so we're just going to wait for it to completely load and then what you're going to do when it's completely loaded you should be able to then go back into your app and try again so by the way uh, like I said before I did this myself and it actually fixed my problem I don't know really why I guess that when there is a new update on the Pokemon TCG pocket app sometimes we get this authorization like kind of error when we try to like go into it if we have the like la like if you have if we don't have the latest uh, like update basically so if you don't have the latest update there might be a lot of bugs basically so that is what i'm trying to say to you so now when it's done just go back into the app itself so we're going to go back and see now if if it works uh, so just a second let's see and i'm just going to tap here to start as you can see it shouldn't it shouldn't give me any more errors now, hopefully. And as you can see, yeah, it now works. I'm back into my account and that is basically exactly how to do this.